payphone era, we back with the round table platform where you can express yourself without getting your head chopped off, allegedly. So we're gonna talk about opinions with different races of people doing different things like different services, food, different things like that and see how people feel about it. So we understand you have a preference on food and services, beauty services and things like that. You can't, uh, I can't got speak a on it. On everything. I don't want a black person cooking my Chinese food. I only want pizza from an Italian. I only want my food done by a Korean. If I get some food, food soup, I want it from Africa. Mm -hmm. Right. Yes. yes. Okay. Yeah. Well, how are you going to know food, food, food. they're Korean? I asked you this before. So you're going to go in and be like, oh, I'm Japanese. So then you're not. Well, I mean, I mean, if you know, like, Japanese got their own thing. Koreans got their own thing. Chinese. Those are all different. They all Asian, but they got their they own culture. But far as the but far as food goes, so you you know as far as food go, any Chinese restaurant you go to, you eating Korean chicken. That's the Korean method of frying chicken. Everybody uses it, so that's one thing they have in common. Everything else is different, and to me, it's like let a person do what they do. How you feel about it? Yeah. Uh, mm. I mean, I understand it. I mean, there's, if I go to a soul food restaurant or an establishment owned by blacks, if they got lasagna on the menu, I'm not eating that. I'm not ordering that. No, no, sir. No. Yeah, Potato right. salad. But I'm, I'm just saying oh, in general. Like, types. You know what to expect <laughs> when you go where you go. True. Right. True, that's a fact. And then it's different types. It's a white, it's a and, yellow. Like. And, you know, whether it's bad or not, I think everybody does that. I mean, we had, well, it's still there, black sub shop, just sandwiches, right? I don't know anybody who got a Italian sub from there. They got ham and cheese. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But an Italian sub, you ain't going to go there for that. Nah. They make good subs. Sandwiches was on yeah. point. But at the same time, there's certain things you want from certain places. And it is funny like that because I was talking to someone and we were talking about Dunkin' Donuts. And I'm like, well, yo, I'm about to go down here, you know, to West Virginia. And I'm like, oh, yeah, I could go to one of the Dunkin' Donuts. And it was like, you know, it ain't going to be right unless Indian people there. Because that's the, the reality in New Jersey. Yeah. You know, all the Indians people own the Dunkin' Donuts and they make it good. It's not that just that they own a lot of the French. They actually make the coffee good. So when you go there, you're like, oh, you got to get real specific with somebody. Else. It could be somebody from any other race. But if you see somebody Indian, you're like, okay, they're going to know. Tell them exactly. So, you know. And I also think you go, unfortunately, you go into certain things with a bias and an expectation. Exactly. Due to whomever you're dealing with on the services. That's right. Who make the best food? Mm. Okay, so here's a here's a flip question. <laughs> Who make the best fried chicken? <coughs> Sometimes it depends where you at too. Now they have the fish fries. We did. Yeah. Where you at? You understand what I'm saying? You gotta depends. let people do what they do. Not even, man. Depends on who have it. Okay, now, so... We don't eat from everybody. No, we don't. Nobody no, we do. Don't. We don't. Nobody do. Nobody could say that they, they eat from everywhere. And it's, no, and it's certain no, things. I don't eat from everywhere, but I'm talking about... I'm the only one in here that work in office space. Okay. They have potlucks and all kind of wild shit all the time. We have friends mm -hmm. giving. I'm the only one that don't never eat none of that. I, ne I don't know y'all. I, I, I don't. I don't eat from yeah, everybody. Yeah. I, I never eat. I, mean, I, I never eat it. I don't know. That, what you that's kind of different. Kitchen. That's kind of different. Saying? My it, thing is, you go try something. Okay. Most companies make more money off of the off of the try factor. I go with that. I go with you that. You feel me? I go with it's that. a promotion. Right. It's for a limited it's time. Yeah. And we'll see what it do. So if some okay, here's here's a way to flip the question. If someone 
does not have a preference about who's cooking the food or who's doing the grooming. Like with me, like I wouldn't go to a non-black to get Neighbors my hair cut. Yeah, no, so no, I'm, I'm, I'm saying somebody like y'all last bar was a white guy comes to you and you're like, well, why didn't you go to a white bar? You don't look no, at it. No, because no. because of that's your profession. No, because right now it's a different time. Okay. They want their hair cut, cut a certain type of way, and that's what we specialize in. Okay. You did? Not saying, not saying that a white guy can't fade or nothing like that, but right. you know, they got their preference, and you know, we 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 get it to where it's at. But I want to take it back real quick to that same thing you posed, but back on the food front. Right? Okay. People say they don't have a preference, but they're lying. They do. They do. Because yeah. and then money, money plays a big part in that too. Correct. True. But you grow up eating, when you grow up, you eat So I like this. And this is what you grow up around. When you go someplace else, if it ain't right, it feel the way. Yo, I, I feel crazy sometimes when I tell you, but I've told you before, told you. If the Chinese restaurant ain't got a little dinge on it, the food ain't good. That's a fact. No bulletproof no, glass. You're, you're talking good. about the Greek. <laughs> no, yeah. no, no, no. That ain't been frying no chicken in there. You don't sell it. Yeah. I don't sell it. I'm cool. It's right. too clean right. in here. You don't right. sell iced right. tea right. and plastic but containers. See, now hold on. Right. Time out. You go to a you go to a Japanese joint. Any spot that serves sushi, right, is gonna have a certain type of cleanliness. Cleanliness to it. I agree, but I because of that, that fat. I, I because of that but, fat. But I'm and I don't mean that the food not good. Two two days days from from the ocean. I'm talking, talking about sushi. Uh, you live ten Chinese hours from, from the, from the beach Japanese talking about sushi. Yeah, I mean, I mean yeah. it's a Vietnamese, it's a Vietnamese place in South Charleston. Right, I brought the great sushi work. with me. Right, shout out to my guy John. You know, he come through and get his hair cut from me. Him and his family over there in South Charleston. Cash cuts and uh, that's Vietnamese. Right, you Full have to you good. have to cop it to knock it. Correct, but at the same time, if you can't afford it, you can't eat it as much. Correct, correct. So a lot of people is like sitting there talking about, oh, I don't eat this and I don't eat that. That's because you can't afford, afford to eat it. Yeah, go try it. Go try it. You can't, so you know. And, and try it to knock but if you've been used to a little bit of paper or whatever, then you have your preference. Right, right. I hate I hate hype with restaurants and food places because then it's like you let down like if I go somewhere that's good I would only tell certain people that I trust I would never try to go somewhere with somebody like yo you gonna love that shit because then if they don't you nah, gonna that, feel okay, disappointed so, so so if I know you love this that and the third and we've been out to eat before and we've done it up yeah, and wow. you know we had this big bill or whatever we, we enjoyed ourselves if I know what you like that's the only way I could tell you that. I can't tell you that. Because it's like that. an example. I got a about a you say about a 10 year run with the new restaurant in New York. <coughs> Soul food buffet joint in Harlem. Never had a bad run with them. Maybe the macaroni or the beans and rice tastes a little different this week. Right. Never, be, but, but I don't want to tell buffet. nobody else. It used to be a buffet. And then it's not good. It was a buffet up here. South Charleston next to the uh, uh, what was the joint? The IHOP joint. Right, right. right. But the IHOP. About, about a marsh. Every Friday they had the seafood Friday. Yo, we used to hit that joint on the regular. Whole cards, whole salmon. Like, yo, like, they really, really did it. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. And it's like, yo, if that was owned by somebody else, I don't know if I would have been there. Yeah. Okay. Right. Makes sense. Makes sense. You understand what I'm saying? Like, like, if I want some, 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 the best Hanan bread, what's the spot over here on the 35th Street? You, you, you come across the 35th yeah. Street Bridge right there. What's the name the of that spot? Beer ass joint. I can't Is it Nuwa? Nuwa. Nuwa. Yeah. I might be saying it wrong, but the best Indian food in the city. And it's like, if I want Indian food, I know where to go. Okay. But if my pocket can't afford it. 
Then why you going I'm there? Going like, to the third string. Say, why you going over there? And then, and then, and then of course the quality <laughs> yeah. gonna suffer because my pockets ain't right. You gotta pay for that quality. Eating and this is the thing. I'm not buying no Indian food right. from nobody else that ain't Indian. I'm right. not buying I'm 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 just not doing fancy, it, man. Fancy food. I'm just not doing yeah, it, man. I'm gonna food. let I'm gonna let people do what they Sing do. Some. And this is the thing. I'm gonna support them for doing what they do. You feel me? Oh, yeah, no question. Okay. Speaking and of- and it ain't no twist or no spin on it. It's just, yeah, I got a preference. Right. I agree with that. You know? Yes, I agree. So, <clears throat> let's talk about some of your favorite TV shows of all time. This is not an order of what was Martin. Better, what was better. It's just Marty Mar. Like. Definitely Mar. Mm-hmm. Marty Mar, Dukes of Hazard. Good time. Wow. Back in the Dukes wow. of Hazard. Yes, I used to watch Dukes of Hazard. Wow. All in the family. Mm. Different tell, strokes. Tell me about a show that Good time. somebody that you Good watched time. that somebody wouldn't think you watched. Yo, any one of them. I used to watch New Old. Old. I used Which, to watch this nighttime. Beavis and Butthead. Definitely yeah, Beavis, Beavis and Butthead. And Butthead. I watched the nighttime soap opera called Dynasty when I was a young uh, boy. Oh, I mean, that was like, that was that huge. Was, yeah. That's huge. I, but nobody would think I'd watch that. Why not? Why not? Why not? That's the that's the nighttime soap opera. Mm. And it was interesting. Okay. Besides Breaking Bad, what else people would think I wouldn't watch? Like Married with children. children. I love married with children. Everybody loved married yeah, with children. Still. That was safe. Okay, safe. What's your name? He already said that. Okay. He already said that. And now he took it to the next level. Something no one would think you would like. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
And your boy, uh, uh, you just said something about different strokes earlier. Mm -hmm. He got a twin brother. His twin brother was in, what was he in? Was he in Mod or so? Conrad Bain, the father? Yeah. He got a twin, twin brother. brother. It was in, um, it was Mod. Yeah, he was in Mod. A twin, hey, Philip Drummond, that's his name. Philip Drummond. Yeah. The curse and of Oak Island. People I, know I know most people didn't fuck with sure. I know everybody fuck with Three's Company, you know, Jack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. yeah. But I fucked with the Ropers too. The Ropers. The Ropers yeah. spinoff, just. Yeah, the spinoff, yeah. 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 I'm, I'm, I'm in tune with all that. Let me tell you why, because that's all that's getting played in my crib. You feel me? Like, all that old shit. Yeah. We done found like three Sorry. or four channels with nothing but old shit. Yeah, yeah. I all the so. black and white joints I'm into, Yo, too. I saw the joint the other all day when I was on Esther. No, I'm talking about I Love Lucy. You oh, see yeah. the yeah. joint with the Honeymoon. Uh, we talking about nothing but black and white. What was your man, though? The plane, the plane. Oh, that's uh, Fantasy Island. On the day I fuck with Andy Griffith, too. Fantasy Island. What you mean? I couldn't stand You can fuck with Andy Griffith every day. No, I couldn't stand it. Black and whites and colors. How about that? Black and whites and colors. Uh, well, they wouldn't know it because the shit's super old. But I fucked with Goma Pal. Who? USA. Yeah, he had his little spinoff. Mash? No, no, no Goma Pal. Pal is a spinoff <laughs> of Andy <laughs> Griffin. Goma. So, uh, you don't know who Gomer is? Yo, stop playing around, man. You ain't cultured enough. You ain't cultured enough. All right, I'm not cultured in TV. I no, it. you're not cultured enough. Everybody know who Gomer Powell is, I bro. know the military dude, the Marine. Yo, don't don't disrespect Gomer. <laughs> I will. Gomer, I will. Gomer, I will. Gomer, I will. Gomer, Gomer, I will. Gomer. I will. Yo, tell if me you no, watch the don't show, disrespect. then you know don't, that. Don't disrespect it. Don't hold no weight. It, it, don't, it don't hold no weight. I ain't disrespect that. I'll fuck Gilligan, you don't mean. disrespect Gilligan. Gilligan neither. Gilligan. You know I'll fuck with Gilligan. Yeah. Gilligan. Was you was the Gilligan. professor. I was Gilligan. Uh, okay. Gilligan had yeah, him rocking the bucket hats. Yes. You feel me? Yes. <laughs> you got to pick either Tell one. Tell me, put some respect on Goma Pile, please. Be which or I dream of Gina. Both. They came on back to back. I know yeah. And I'm watching them back to back. Eve. I'm watching them back to back. Put some respect or in reverse, or maybe it. however it go, I'm watching them both because you watch me they were entertainment. Yes, yeah. indeed. Yeah. <laughs> and the Brady Bunch too. You yeah. had to. Those yeah. were yeah. Yeah. those were lineups. Mm -hmm. And anybody know what I'm talking about? Knowing like, yeah, if you lived in the tri-state area, yeah. that was your TV lineup. I, you know what I did? Full house, raw pains, all that it. came I later. Who's the boss? I dream of Jeannie. I did not, not like I dream of Jeannie. There's two different ones, though. Which the old one? one from back in the day from up the way? No, it's two Jeannie. different husbands, though. Yeah, there was one. Okay, they're both whack. No. <laughs> they was both no. whack. <laughs> no. I dream of Jeannie. On a good, so chill I'm day. No, I'm not watching. You could tune into a couple of episodes of I Dream of Genie and it'll do you all right. We ain't watching no Ricky Lake. We ain't watching no Ricky Lake. I couldn't watch that. We ain't watching no Ricky Lake. None of them. Oh, I hate them. Shows. I was a huge Robert Downey Jr. Mm. show. Boot fan. <laughs> mm -hmm. Robert Downey If you Jr. didn't know, that was another show that I liked that you wouldn't think I would. What? I don't know. Robert Downey Jr. show. It used to come on Channel 9. Mm. Up top, back in the day. Mm. The what do you call yourself? The mouth? Mm. Something. I forgot what it was. But Robert Downey Jr., he had a good show. And I fucked with Airwolf. Mm. Airwolf? I mean, yeah, those, those were popular yeah, shows, yeah, though. Yeah, but not everybody fucked with that. Not they everybody. might not know or remember, but yeah, Airwolf was a popular yeah, show. Most definitely. So we, we say all that to say there's, there's a lot of shows. Everybody got. A lot of TV shows, everybody got different preferences. We could go on, you know, for days with that. But um, some of your favorite movies, remember, these are not orders. These are just preferences, like a movie. Favorite movie. My movie. favorite movie. Of all not, time. not, fa see, you can I'm see. just saying, yeah, I, okay, you, what's you that? Just name a movie, yeah. but my favorite yeah. is called Once Upon a Time in America. Oh, mm. man. Three hours. Mm. Old American oh, me yeah. over here. <laughs> <laughs> yo, it's one of the only gangsters. Old American yo, they, start, they start from this high. 
It's where your man ran up noodles. That's yeah. where that comes from. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, bro. Movie I like. Um, I ain't a big movie dude, you know, but the ones I like, I like. I like Fargo. It's one of my favorite movies. Uh, I like... Yeah. Uh, no, you know, that's too easy. Without, like that. Give me, tell me about a movie that I wouldn't think you would like. Killer Irishman. I would think you would like that. <laughs> I like that. Hold on, what's the number? I like right? Killer Irishman. Some more um, that was a Scorsese. Come Hella High Water. A anything Scorsese you can't get. Come Hella High Water. I like that movie. Hmm. I like Come Hella High Water. That I need, I need, Jermaine, Jeff I need Bridges. pay phone era movie that I wouldn't expect you to like. Damn, what was the movie with the Italian um, <laughs> delivery pizza boy? He was sleeping with all the chicks in Cali. Uh, 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 damn, he used to come on all the time. That used to be my job. What, Boogie Boogie Night? Night? Nah, it wasn't Boogie Nights. It was Dirt, young was Dirt Dirt I think it was the Karate Kid. <laughs> It wasn't Dirk Diggle. <laughs> the Jack Hammer. <laughs> nah, it wasn't the Jack Hammer. The Jack Hammer. It definitely wasn't the Jack Hammer. Um, movies that you wouldn't uh, think I'd like. Mm -hmm. like. He said Weekend at Bernie. Yeah, that, Weekend was, at Bernie. that was a big movie. Everybody liked Weekend at Bernie. Everybody That's liked the Goonies. Goonies. Everybody liked Gremlins. Robocop. Okay. Nah, like, like, like all the yeah, you did. No, I didn't. Yeah, did. I didn't like if Robo you ain't like one, you like part two. <laughs> I didn't yeah, like Robo Cop. You talking about like the, like uh, the Manhattan, Manhattan Project yeah. from the 80s? Yeah, what about Sonny Carson? So, you like all uh, you like uh, Oppenheimer now? Then, Sonny yeah. Carson, what about the last dragon? <laughs> Leroy Green. Leroy Green. Show no. Leroy Green over here. Oh, oh, man. Show no. What? Show no. That was a classic. Uh, now, you know about the right. horror right. movie? Right. It was Eddie Arcadian. Yeah. I mean, you know. He was the record producer mm -hmm. of The Mobster. Classic. Yeah, the just the classics, yeah. The crust grooves, you know. Oh, Y'all just gonna skip over Action Jackson like that? Mm. Oh. Boots. Y'all gonna <laughs> skip action. over Action <laughs> Jackson? Yeah, Action Jackson. No Action yeah. Jackson? Yeah. Action Jackson? Yeah. When yeah. Action Jackson yeah. came out? I don't know. The year before yeah. The Predator? Yeah. Yeah. I, I that was 86, predator. right? I did The Predator. You gonna front on Action Jackson yeah. and Manly? No, you not. Yeah. We ain't gonna let you do that. R.I.P. to Carl I'm Weathers. A, I'm a front Carl Weathers Rambo. just passed too, yeah. so we gotta give uh, it up to him. The original gangsters. Yeah, the original movie gangsters. The, 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 the that's later on. It's still paid for. With Shaheen. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. man. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We just uh, watching that what uh, last uh, night. We like watching that in, in the shop. Oh, uh, what they categorize? Come on, come on now, you know I do. Okay. Uh -huh. All across the hundred and ten streets. You already what, know. What's Scatter say? What's Scatter say? The, the movie and the song. Yeah. What's, yeah. What's, oh yeah. That music on that, that is crap. And crap across the hundred and ten streets. I tell you another joint that the soundtrack. I got on the Scully every that, time you that see. That's the um, soundtrack dope. It's called Cotton Comes to Harlem. Oh, uh, 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 yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. Yeah. What about the Let's Do It Again soundtrack? Yeah. But the Let's mm. Do It Again. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, so you yeah. You hear it all, boy. Yeah. Those yeah. them joint, those yeah. them yeah. joints yeah. that I like yeah. that you didn't suit. know that I like. Okay. I'm very, very well coached. I'm telling you, I be tapping in. I be finding joints that you would just skip over. You keep scrolling. Why well, gotta keep scrolling? Why that's can't what you do? Keep scrolling. No, no, why, 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 why gotta keep scrolling? That's what you do. That's what yeah, you do. Yeah, right. he's right. That's what you do. Just to say it, like, you know what I'm saying? I mean, hey, hey. You know what to say it. That's how you don't know. I like the movies I like. Like what? Name one. I told you. Give me something good. Like, give me something that I could. That no I can country tell some for old men. Everybody's not tuning in to the to the to the Mexican. Yellow, with the, yellow he looks stone. like the mannequin Jake. Remember the saying. mannequin we used to get in barber school. Oh, yeah. That's like, who. That's, that's, that's who it looked like. Though, no, movie. no, no. Everybody's not tapping in. Yeah, I ain't tapping. It's a that. good movie to old no, western no. gangster movie. No, novels. it ain't that though. What? Ain't really all that. The plot is well, somebody got some bread. Somebody sent a hitman. 
And it's just a Tom and Jerry until one I'm catch not, the other. I'm not movie crazy, but I'm, I'm thinking. It's so many movies that slip through the cracks. Yeah, I'm man. an avid movie besides watcher. Besides the regular ones, you know, besides, you know, the Lifes and the Half Bakes and the no, Napoleon no, Dynamites. Man, listen, and man. It's like, Let yeah. me tell you the movie I watch more than any movie ever. Belly. Mm. You got dope mm. for Spark. Mm. And I'm gonna tell you why, like, like, that's my era. That's we live. That's now. everything that encompass everything right there on Bell. Belly's too real. For up, who? Up to the part when they jumped out the window. Got it was too much. That Scarface. You know what was going on when Belly came out. Beads under the do rag. And he don't floss, but he got dope. <laughs> you had the beads under the do rag. No, you did. I never rocked the do rag. <laughs> never. Uh, but do rag's one of my favorite songs. Shout out yeah. to Escobar. You already know. So what's so um speaking of that, since you brought that up, so name a song that bring back a memory. Don't have to be a hip hop song, a rap song. Just a song that brings <laughs> A memory. It could you can either go. It, it could be any era. So no, go back some. Like the stand song. on the block, gun cock, Reebok, avalanche rock, get yeah, paid yeah. off, mass murderous services. Okay. Oh my oh, lord. That joint they used to play at the end of every part. Of Where I want to thank you. Mm. Heavenly Father. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. 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 classic. Oh, yeah, yeah. Whenever, that, whenever that come on, that's one of them you close your eyes for a minute, stretch your mm -hmm. leg. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. Got anything, Kai? Man, we already know. What you got? Right. We already know. No, we don't, because you no, said we that. don't know. Can it be that it was all so mm. simple again? I mean, that's a, yeah, yeah, simple. Ooh. That's a whole. Said, I mean, that did a lot for a lot of people, ball. though. Damn, What's I Ready got one? What's the, what was the best song? What about the, the remix? Club song, the remix. Yeah. Check my yeah. 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 out. Yeah, yeah, the cake. Yeah, let me find that fast rate. Yeah, you already know. You already know. Club the club. I lay my head is my home, and when I die, you still be listening to that. You. You tapped in with the old music. I mean, some shows. I'm, I'm an old sure. soul. That's first. All right. Foremost. So if you're an old soul, are you I'm tapping, tapping in. in. I'm or tapping you're in. For confirmation. I'm tapping in. This the thing. I will never tap in while nobody else is around. So okay. that we don't want. But those be, be my joint. Yeah. The, uh, Me too. I would call it what Sunday cleaning music. Right. Those yeah. joints is why I got up right. early in the morning on Sunday. I got up. And I turn the music on, medium loud. I lit some incense, some candles, and I start mm -hmm. fucking cleaning. Mine the whole done. damn house. Yeah, I do that. I got my songs. Okay, then. Songs there you too. go. Those, those are what yeah. those do. It's like the Dell Phonics. No, I mean, I can't, I can't just say the Dell no specifics. No, I, I can't have name. specifics on the, the little I, playlist. Yeah. For me. I'm talking about yeah. for me. Yeah, I, I hear you on the Dells because a couple of the Dells going to come on. Yeah. They in there. Everything in the twine. You feel me? So do you think music provoke bad behavior? Just like it promote uh, good behavior. All right, all right, all right. You it's you it's two ways we could do this. Okay. It's two days we could do this. The first way is as an adult, as an adult, you gotta hold yourself responsible for everything. Yeah. And another way is, oh, I was drunk and I was high and uh, it was the peer pressure, and, and the homies had my back, so I went in. So the, the music tells them to do that? Not necessarily. Music couldn't tell you nothing to do, not as a consenting adult. If something's wrong with you, or you have some kind of, you know, some kind of mental, you know, some kind of, if you got some kind of issues, then maybe you can blame it on that. Yeah. You feel me? Yeah. You so can't. You a person can't go in there and be like, yeah, a song told me to do this, this, that, and the third. And no, even if that, you but did. That's how they make it seem. But even if you did, that's not going to work, man. 
No, it's, it doesn't work in the court of law, but it works. Okay, in the well, court. the court of law is, it, no, no, is the talk, law. We talking about the court of ignorance. Like people, no, I, I don't believe it at all. I believe you're going to do what you're going to do. Oh, I, this is what I mean about being an adult. Yes. I think it's a 50 uh, 50 mix. Uh -huh. So what? Because, yeah, listen, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. Our era. You better watch what you say. People in our age. Same I'm about to be quiet. You better watch what you say. I'm about to be quiet. People in our age group, right? When we wanted to get involved with hip hop, the music it wasn't violent. Yeah. You had to spit. You you had to be a spitter. I mean, we had our just ices and but the music. Ice tea. You didn't have to be a gangster to be involved. Mm -hmm. The way that it evolves now, someone young listening. I want to be involved. I don't years. think the no, music no, no. makes them violent, but if I want to be down, I want to be on this scene, this is what they're doing. So it does have some sort of influence to some degree. Now, now if your 10 year old is listening to, to the music and you ain't got no control over that, that's on you. Do you understand what I'm saying? Because mm -hmm. I agree with you. Once you reach a certain level, come on, bro. You you know yeah. better. We yeah. can. Yeah. But it's not just that demographic no, that so listens this to is the my music. Deal. It's a That's my people. deal. You know what I mean? When are you just going to respect entertainment for being entertaining? People don't. You understand that's what, what I'm they saying? They have to look to. They not. We like you said being. No, grown, everybody want to be entertained, but at certain at a certain point, you gotta. Remember you know. This. Like, like, come on, man. I got to go to work in the morning, man. I got to pay this bill by Thursday. My wifey need this by Friday. I'm supposed to be going here on Saturday. Like, as a consenting adult, you got stuff to do. So, yeah, you, 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 you absorb the music and you hear what he's saying, but that don't control nothing about you. I agree with that as an adult. I True. Agree. As an adult. True. You feel me? Yep. Like, what you gonna be a sucker that uh, walk by some niggas you don't like? Excuse my language. You know, you gonna walk by somebody you don't like and you're singing a song that says some stuff that them, say some stuff to them that you can't say yourself? It's a lot of suckers out there, but, you mm -hmm. know, and that's what they call the drill music. All the drill music is like pretty much the truth or a... Uh, 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 a braggadocious way of self snitching or self interrogating. We need to do interviews on that. I mean, I, I'm not yes. that tapped in, but I know that these dudes yes. be telling that they did all kinds of shit on the song, mm -hmm. and it be the truth. So if I'm so, people, what's the difference I'm between people. getting behind a camera and some lights and making a video versus the interrogation room? That's why they're using their tapes against them now. Go ahead. No, I just was saying, um, if people are influenced by them younger people, if they following the rappers because they don't have role models or whatever the case is, if they do or they just want to be in, like he said, role they, model or not, and they, and they, they role follow, model or not, a kid is gonna latch on or or follow whatever they want. I mean, you could be the best parent in the world, yeah, but it's still, ultimately huh? up to the kid. Yeah. On 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 what's important to them? Only up to a certain age. Yeah. Up to I a mean, certain age, you in full you in full control. Yeah. Okay. Up to a certain age, you up the parents in full control. Yeah, but that don't mean nothing. You could be the best parent in the world, and your kid to go do something that's that you never yeah. thought that they would do. That's a fact. I agree with that. Different, different world. world. You understand what I'm saying? You understand what I'm saying? Like, so true. you could be you could be the best facilitator, the best. Talker, the best. You got all these understandings with your child, and your child will still go out and do something stupid. Mm, that's a fact. But this is the deal. I'm not saying it's necessarily the music, but the music might play a part. I don't if know if it's the peer pressure because they not. Do you understand? I don't know if it's the peer pressure, and yeah, you know, from we from the neighborhood, so now I'm gang gang, right. and and this is what we doing because I have to do it because this my hood and. You know, all these these uh, uh, untapped in conversations. A lot of these people don't know what the hell is going on with their kids because their kids ain't telling them. Yeah. Oh, yo, these and dudes from around the corner want a problem. Me and my dudes, we, we a gang now then. 
You know, they don't they don't know no better. They just doing what they feel is the right thing to do. And, and, and it's not a lot of that going on. So it's a lot of kids just running around doing whatever. And you saying, oh, do I think they influenced by the music? Very small percent because if you live in something somebody did in the rap song, you know dude in the rap song can't do that unless he can't make yeah. songs no more. Yeah, well, yeah. I'm just saying, you got kids that's from real, real good areas that get in there, you know, real good families. I can attest to that. Like, it don't matter. Like, geez, what a waste. It don't matter. You got, you got what? What they made up? The good girl gone bad? What about the good cook? The good kid that went bad? Yeah, that's a lot of them. Because he need money. And so he getting money, now you got to affiliate yourself with this game because... He need protection to keep on getting his money. Feel me? Okay. Nobody don't want to be the lame and just go to school mm -hmm. and go to college. Because they broke the whole time. Nobody ain't interested in them. That's the truth. That These kids true. out here like, yo, you went to I'm college living. and you don't even have a job in your field. Mm -hmm. You They're fucked up in the game. You, you feel me? Yeah. My social life is a wreck because I ain't got it. I ain't popping. They ain't fucking with me. I can't even afford a bottle of liquor. The shit that I drink, I drink E and J. No, not me per se, but the person I drink E and J in. You drink E and J. They want what's the name? They e &J. want Hennessy. Right, 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 right. Feel me? Right. I can't afford them. Mm. So I'm not in their league and oh now I gotta step my game up and I'm ten toes down mm -hmm. and it's all these illusions out here. It's all yes, this and a lot of them are influenced by through music. I disagree, man. Some of them images are through it's music. A, it's a small percentage. Yes, it's, it's, there is a percentage. It's a small percentage. The drugs, I think the social drink, media yeah. got a bigger influence yeah. on these but kids the today stems off of music. than music, though. No, I think yeah. it's the other way around. Yeah. I think it's the other way around. The music is, is more so the soundtrack. That's so why I'm out here doing all this bullshit, this is what I'm listening to. Because this is the newest, latest, hottest shit. Okay, speak, speaking of people, to keep on the subject, but switch it up. But speaking of people listening to people, and we didn't have a test on this from none of the round tables, but do you do um female hip hop artists and R&B singers need to be quote unquote eye candy or sexual to sell records or be taken seriously or can they rely on their skills? Because we all know a lot of people that should have blew probably more than they was, but they wasn't willing to go Let's there. do this another way. Okay, Captain. Is it easier to listen to somebody that's easy on the eyes or is it harder to listen to somebody that's hard on the eyes? I think if the song is good, it's just good. Let me say that again. Is it easier to listen to somebody that's easy on the eyes or harder to listen to somebody that's hard on the eyes? What I'm saying is, <laughs> since she ain't that cute, yeah, ain't I really cool. don't hear her. Uh, boy, I hear her because so she's cute. Listen, man. Or she look good man. and she's talking that shit. Listen. So that's the real question. Yeah. Like, what's the name? Do dope? bars matter? Yeah. Hell what's yeah. the name? Rhapsody. Dope if you for ain't me. that cute. Hold on, hold on. Like, I like rap. Yeah, so bars yeah. matter if you ain't that cute. Okay. And, and be right. You got to wear natty days, female rap. Oh, you got to have your ass out, titties out, and like, come on. Bars, like, I listen bars to, don't matter. I listen to, like, I listen to Rhapsody. <laughs> you feel me? She's cute. Yeah, she don't do that, in, but she ain't spit, doing yeah, all that extra. Yeah, and guess spit, what? Yeah, and she ain't she, blowing either, because I don't know. Yeah, she, she, do, she do. Because we know. tap yeah. in. Yeah, she so only she, need her hardcore fan base. Is, she's not. So she ain't up, cute. Like, you look at it. She's okay, a, yeah, no, she is. She is. She a queen. But she's not queen. Because she don't show a body. I mean, besides a queen. I don't know. That's how it is. I don't know. Everybody's queen. Yes. Really? That's that's yeah. what it is now. Uh, so the way right. Right. Just like everybody ain't kings. Oh, okay. Everybody ain't kings, everybody ain't queens. Oh. Boom. Ain't enough kingdoms. Mm. Mm. Damn. 
You're going to strike a chord with that one. Mm. But do I think... So they self-proclaimed queens? I don't what? think you need to... I don't think they got to do that if the music correct. Yeah. They don't have to do nothing so they can... They well, is it correct? music first or image these days? And I tell you, they didn't say these days. They ain't say these days. We say it in general, is. on the whole. Well, on, well, on the whole. Like I said, to the if she question. easy on her eyes, she easy to listen to. If it's hard to look at, it's hard to listen to her. I'm going to leave it alone. I don't agree with that. All right, because most of the time you heard a motherfucker first before you saw him. That's what era we yeah, from. Yes. Okay. Nowadays, a motherfucker going viral for doing some shit that ain't got shit to do with music. Then you hear the song, you be like, oh, okay, I get it. And that's how it's working. That's how it's working. So how, how, how am I wrong for saying what I'm saying? I'm not. Trust me. You are. No, I'm not. A motherfucker go viral for doing some shit that ain't got uh, shit to do with music the song, and then put out the song. Yeah. And now we like, oh, I get it. So if a motherfucker went in McDonald's and wild out on or come out before that on a, on, on the train he cashier because they didn't know this, that, and the third, and then made a song about it and oh fuck the bitch at McDonald's and it's a big yeah, ass hit. Okay. It right. went viral because they had the re the actual oh, footage, it's but it's that old. was just a trainee. She didn't know what she was doing. She didn't deserve that, but it served its purpose. We five, ten million dollars in. We done did all these shows off the same song. Fuck the bitch at McDonald's. It went viral. You getting paid off the memes. You getting paid off all the, it's so many streams of revenue now. Yeah. So speaking of some uh, before we wrap it up, just uh to touch on somebody that was around before the streams of revenue. We wanna do a um round table artist spotlight on um on Ghostface Killer. The God! Mm -hmm. On Ghost. So Ghost is a member of the Wu. Mm -hmm. As, uh, it says 13 solo albums when I got this, but it's actually 14 because he just did that Christmas joint. Mm -hmm. All right, well, so for, I, I want to take this moment to say we're going to touch on that in a later date. And we're going to do a whole, a whole little capsule mm -hmm. on Ghost. Okay. So, so just get stopped. some briefs on what we gonna do. Yeah, the, 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 uh, top four. verses, off the top. What we gonna win? Mm. 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 You know my favorite is the Jooks. Mm. Apollo Kids. But my favorite is the Jooks, but we know. Mm -hmm. Do we believe Lord Superb or not? I was listening to Superb yesterday, and I, then I said, we're "Do we here. believe Superb or not?" I, I don't know because if the Jukes is my favorite song but by Ghostface, and somebody else might have lended the ink or pinned the whole shit, but what about the material before and after? I'm not taking nothing from Perb. What do you Perb mean? Ghost made good. We ain't talking about before. nothing before or after. We talking about that. If Bird broke that and he went to the store and he came back and Ghost had the whole shit laid. But that's just your preference of That ain't song. my preference. That's what the nigga you Perk said. That's said. your favorite song. Not yeah, just that, yo, that's Perk. that's uh, besides the joint where he, uh Jane uh Jamie died or whatever and told him to rock yeah. with respect. Besides them two, what we talking about here, man? For real, for real. We talking about Ghostface? Yeah. And this catalog, those two. That's it. That's it. Nothing ain't topping them. Stop, stop, stop the bullshit. Oh, ain't nothing topping them. I let two. you sit up here. Ain't all nobody night topping them two. With this arson. Ghost will tell you ain't nothing topping them two. He sat up here all night. God damn it. You sat up here all night with ain't this. Ain't nobody shit. topping That's them it two. To ghost. Ask Ghost. Apollo Kids? Yo, he got better rhymes than Apollo Kids. Apollo Kids was a he good song. He had a lot of better rhymes. It was a good song. But you just say it. I said jokes. verses. I said verses. Verses. Um, the first verse off the Jukes. Okay. Come in the building. I want to see your three. That's it. Come in the building, nigga. Pop your collar. Come on, man. man it's, come he's on. Got we got talking man. about tor storytelling. Yeah. Yes. The ambiance. The flow. Just ghost being ghost. Yes. That Sometimes everything about ghost. Yes. Everything about ghost is yes. that. Yes. 
Hats down low on the range, Rain, switch, switch lanes, change my tire, fill out. Come on, we talking yeah. go. But you he just said, didn't say that. He said, I'm not gonna let you no. just say that. He said, uh, 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 three dice, two bags of dope. Ooh, rev ain't right. Yeah. This church ain't yes. right. Yes. yes. Deacon was a pimp, you can no, tell no, by no, his no. eyes. So brother starved me, meet me at the number spot. spot. I heard you got red time sound. Yeah. And I want to lie. Sure, we fainted dead on the spot. Two, yeah. Come but on, that, damn. It. Those them joints. He, he has more. All right, all right. He, he has, has so much more, but guess okay. what? But guess uh, what? That's your favorite. No, that's those are everybody's favorite. Oh, shit. That's the shit that made Ghost famous. I they say it back That's in the, the day. shit that made Ghost famous. I they say it back yeah. in the day. The them joints I told you. Those them joints I'm talking about. Cash, how they say it back in the day. It was famous before the joints. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the, 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 the the that ain't fair. The jokes is down. That ain't fair. The jokes is down. The, 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 just like, the, how about this? How about this? How about this? Do Old Wolf the Weird of Poetry is my favorite Ghostface song. Okay. Yeah. How about that? Yeah, I know. But when it comes to top verses, in your opinion, as a basketball player, no, man. We talking about Ghostface Killer. We talking about Ghost Demon. With the mask. That's right. With the mask. Throw, oh, make, throwing niggas off. Not the nigga things. with the roll. Throwing niggas and, and, off and, and, and the extra crispy bed and the big giant slick Rick medallion with the eagle. I ain't talking about him. I'm talking okay. about ghosts with the mask. Okay. What about That's Sunday what I thought. Night? That's you what I thought. Man. I'm Two trying to tell you about was, ghosts. Y'all know ghosts. Two we was raised on ghosts. Monday night, Dallas versus Jets. Duke slid in with one hand. Two coach disciples, one bag of wet. Heavy rain, fuck my kicks up. Oh, Boy, yeah. Look, it splashed in the puddle. You going just the jokes? This is ghosts. This is a nigga with an eagle on his arm who got it melted <laughs> down yeah. for four four finger rings. All right? That's what he said. He melted it down for four four. <laughs> you ain't know that, did you? You know what I'm saying? He melted it down. Yo, yeah. yo. You can't just do the jokes. jokes. No, just the joke. That's about, it. I'm talking about as far as per popularity. <laughs> See, so you oh, a ghost yeah. head, so you know that. Yes. The shit yes. you just said, nobody yes. don't know what the fuck you talking yeah. about. Mm -hmm. But everybody know what the fuck I'm talking about. A, a pair of bright, fat, yellow Air Max hit the racks. No, Snatch them up, son. Yeah, $20 yeah, you know. off, no tax. Woo! Come on, man. Woo! Yes, yes, yeah. I'm a ghost Woo! head. So you I'm a ghost Just head. the jokes, yeah. just the jokes. No, no not, I never said that. I said that. The jokes and a couple other joints is what okay. made Ghostface. Okay. Here, here's a hardball. Is there a ghost face without Raekwon? Most definitely. Most definitely. Mm -hmm. Like, that's like asking, is it a Raekwon without Go? Enhancement? No enhancement? I mean, they uh, they the enhancements for each other. You feel me? So, guess what? I'm fucking with Ray, but guess what? Oh, he got ghosts on there. It's over. Yeah. Yeah. It's over. He got ghosts on there. Yeah, I'm Ray, fucking yeah, with ghosts. Yeah. Oh, he got Ray on there. It's Ray over. On the EPMD. Ghosts got Ray. Ray yeah, got ghosts. Yeah, Paris Smith. Yeah. New you version. take them together, but they, they mean, go separate. Hey, they hey, go separate. hey. They separate. You feel me? One a word, Smith, and one one a bar you down. Ray a rapper. Yeah. Ghost, ghost more. He can rhyme more. I sing. He told you that already. He can rhyme there I sing. There you go. There you go. In my Yankee hat, you can drop five beans. There you go. <laughs> there you go. So that's oh, our yeah. that's our artist spotlight for um payphone era ghost. Told killer. me rock it with respect. <laughs> mm. That's been energy left. Nah. Come on, man. Just left under yeah. them straight up. Um, <laughs> yeah, outside the check cash. Yeah. And don't forget that. Ooh. Outside the check cash. Outside the check. Come on, man. Go. Just the that's like cash. That's like that core mega. Yeah. That's like that core mega. Yeah. I'm on the bench high. He ain't chicken wings. Yeah. 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 Hey, mega. Right hey, mega. Too. We fuck with you, boy. Crack. We got to do an artist spotlight. Ghost,
Yeah, we got to fuck with Megan, too. Like you said, ghosts with Ray Luck never be the same again. Yeah. Because you understand those things you think. Yeah, he just going to say the jokes. No, that was... No, I I did not. Why you keep saying that? That's not what I said. I said the jokes is in that top five. For you. As far as Ghostface versus, he... Yo. I would say ice cream or something. No, the fuck you wouldn't. No, you wouldn't. Tell me what I would say. If you wouldn't. I'm not letting you say that to me because I know better. Because I know what we I'm used to ride to. I know what we used to ride to. Never be the same again. We ain't never rode to that. <laughs> <laughs> and we ain't. How about that? Uh, you did? Like There's so much ghost about, shit. Yeah. Like, even if you talk about the features, like, come on. Yeah. The features. Come on, with that. Like, run. Like, whose run was better? Oh. Capadonna or Ghostface? We not doing that. Ooh. Yeah, you did it before. I'm just All right, so Kappa, we already know that Kappa is like the OG rapper. Yeah. Freestyle and bust you down on a spot on his yeah. way home from work or to work or whatever the case may be. But I never compared them to. Nah, I wouldn't compare him. But I fuck with Kappa, and niggas can't fuck with Kappa. When the war said it all, and Ghost said it itself that a nigga came in there and bust everybody ass. And Ghost said Gorilla. Ghost said that Kappa came in there and bust everybody ass. Okay. You heard? So. Shout out to Kappa Donna. Shout out to Kappa. Oh, Donna. The album, The Pillage. Pillage was... That guy used to bang the fucking pillage to death. Pillage was the shit. He said, my slang is editorial. Explicit mm-hmm. material. Briefcase yes. flow. Yeah. Rhyme the stereo flow. Don the real G. Kill the bees got the best D. Kill the bees those... got it like D. So you True need, master you on the key. The dog specialist. And the Raekwons and all Everybody, that. yo, yo. Balance. Everybody yeah. is... Piggybacking on each other to create this big giant Wu Tang monster. They accomplished that shit. Mm-hmm. That's why they got a residency yeah. now because guess Still what? Uh, uh, these niggas go give us uh, five million dollars. You get a million, I get it, and so on and so forth. We pay production. And guess what? You do three, I do three, uh, yeah, and that's going to fill up the top. Mm-hmm. That's a bet. And then we yeah. gonna go hit the, the lobster and the steak buffet that costs $199 in Vegas. And, and that's to, how we end in our night. Every night, lobsters and steaks and champagne. After we gonna make a million dollars. Feel me? 